Welcome to Top 10 Archive. Continuing our grand tour of the world, we're journeying back to the Southern Hemisphere to explore the highly suggested South Africa. From breathtaking waterfalls and majestic wildlife to being home to some of the most intriguing shipwrecks to have ever been found, we'll take a look at 10 amazing facts about South Africa. Number 10, Fame of South Africa. Often confused for Morgan Freeman by some individuals, Nelson Mandela was one of South Africa's most notable celebrities, known for being an anti-apartheid revolutionary politician, philanthropist, and even served as president to his home country for five years. Other South Africans include actress and model Charlize Theron, or Charlize Throne, Lord of the Rings author J.R.R. Tolkien, singer-songwriter Dave Matthews, Charlotte Copley, and Neil Bloomkamp. Cricket enthusiasts may recognize Dale Stein, Joshua Peters, and A.B. de Villiers, while Sipaway Shabalala and Brian Habana will strike soccer and rugby fans. He may not be as recognized, but Nobel Peace Prize winner Bishop Desmond Tutu also needs a well-deserved mention. In YouTube land, be sure to check out more Casper, Kruger sightings, Cobus Pochita, and SixPackFactory.com. Number 9. South African Innovations from life-saving devices to fascinating and unexpected contributions to science, South Africa has put forth some worthwhile creations. Among them was the concept of transverse axial scanning, a technique partially attributed to Alan McLeod Cormick that eventually led to the common CAT or CAT scan. Not quite as medically necessary, but impressive nonetheless, was also George Prattley's Prattley Putty. The adhesive was used in the Apollo 11 moon landing to keep the Eagle landing craft from falling apart. Other notable creations include dolos, or the geometric concrete blocks that protect harbor walls, thin solar cells, the speed gun used for most ball-based sports, and cyber tracker that allowed for the tracking of animals via a GPS-like device. Number eight, South African cuisine. Get your notepads ready because it's time to dive into some South African cuisine. The sweeter side of local cuisine comes in the form of Cook Sisters, or sweet, deep-fried pastries. But before you get to dessert, you'll need to eat your biltong, bobodi, pokikos, or frikadelle. Though known for its indigenous flavors, South Africa has also adopted many means of cooking from the many colonies that passed through, including German, French, Italian, British, and Greek. If you find yourself traveling to Cape Town, be sure to check out The Gold Restaurant, before you start your traditional lentil dal with roasted butternut, be entertained by an interactive djembe drumming session followed by a customary hand-washing ceremony. Number 7. Tourist Attractions Travelers to South Africa have chosen a country rich with nature and plenty to see and do. From Kruger National Park to Yusaka Marine World and West Coast Fossil Park, travelers that want to get close to South Africa's more natural side have two great outlets. Beach lovers will want to flock to Cape Town, while those wanting to get a look at the country's history will want to see the District 6 Museum, the Cradle of Humankind, and the South African National Museum of Military History. There's nothing more fascinating than the massive hole in Kimberley, South Africa, which was once the site of a massive diamond rush. The 214-meter or 702-foot deep cavern hosts one of the country's most intriguing tourist attractions. Number 6. South African Wildlife Among South Africa's most common wildlife are what's considered the Big Five – elephants, buffalo, lions, rhinos, and leopards. Beyond these majestic, albeit common folk, is a country brimming with life, including 230 mammal species, of which 13 fall within endangered and critically endangered. Among some of the flourishing wildlife are the Cape Grisbach, Cape Horseshoe Bat, Geometric Tortoise, Southern Adder, Cape Legless Skink, Blue Crane, Mountain Zebra, Saywell, and Blue Whale. What may be a bit surprising is the colony of penguins located at Boulders Beach, who are celebrated each October with Penguin Awareness Day. Number five, increase in education. While parts of the world seem to be suffering from a visible decline in quality of education, South Africa has been experiencing quite the opposite shift. In 2011, there was a near 4% increase of people aged 20 or older who obtained some type of higher education, bringing the number from 8.4% to 12.1%.
To coincide with this change, the percentage of people who had absolutely no schooling dropped considerably from 17.9% to 8.6%, which may also help explain the drop in illiteracy rates, which went from 31.5% in 2001 to 19.1% a decade later. Number 4. South African Nature Attractions Great sights to visit, eclectic cuisine, majestic wildlife, South Africa seems to have it all. And that's not even considering the impressive geography and environment that encapsulates the impressive wonder of this Southern Hemisphere country. The Makamwa Mountains along the border of Umpangalanga and Swaziland are estimated to be approximately 3.6 billion years old, making its rock some of the oldest ever recorded. South Africa is also said to house the second tallest waterfall in the world, Tugela Falls. The falls come in at 948 meters or 3,110 feet high, falling just 30 meters or 100 feet short of Venezuela's Angel Falls. As if that duo weren't enough, there's also Blyde River Canyon, possibly the third largest in the world and largest green canyon. Number three, nuts over mining and minerals. Diamonds aren't the only thing that South Africa is known for mining. In fact, it's recognized for having one of the greatest remaining reserves estimating a worth of around two and a half trillion dollars. As a world leader in mining, South Africa accounts for 80% of manganese mining, 73% of chrome, 45% of vanadium, and 41% of the world's gold supply. 20% of the country's GDP comes from mining, generating an estimated $34 billion annually. If minerals don't tickle your fancy, maybe macadamia nuts will do the trick. According to exports, South Africa is one of the leading exports of the tiny morsel. In fact, in 2014, South Africa produced roughly 25% of the entire world's supply of macadamia nuts, and the number is expected to rise year after year. Number two, a land of shipwrecks. We talked about the beautiful beaches of Cape Town, but there's something far more interesting about South Africa's coast. For over 500 years, the Cape of Good Hope has been the unfortunate site to some 3,000 ships. The Sacramento, the Grosvenor, the Waratah, and the Arniston are among the many, many notable vessels that call the Cape their final resting place. From as early as the 1500s, ships have been succumbing to the dangerous reefs and poor visibility, leading to the construction of lighthouses up and down the coast. Many even claim to have seen the ghostly Flying Dutchman scouting the deadly shore. Number 1. The Cradle of Mankind Tracing the history of man is an extensive endeavor, but a good portion of it could be done right in South Africa. Over two and a half million years of human history can be traced to an area of South Africa known as the Cradle of Humankind. It's in this area that over 40% of all human ancestor fossils have been discovered, including the 1947 discovery of an Australopithecus africanus, the earliest ape form species classified as a hominin. The caves offer a look at early ecosystems even long before hominid presence, making South Africa one of the world's most prehistorically important countries. Do you have an idea for a future top 10 video? Let us know in the comment section below. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and our website, top10archive.net. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with all of your family and friends.